there is extremely strong research uh, going on in ICU. Um, you've got funding, you've got a lot of uh, support staff. Um, there's a statistical help, people help with posters. I mean, there's so much assistance here um, that I knew that if I wanted to do research here, it would be a much easier place to do it than almost anywhere else I would, I would go. Mayo has a um, phenomenal reputation for development of academic careers. Because of the, this strong interest at Mayo, your research interests can be supported no matter what they are, be them clinical, um, translational, or pure basic science. They exist here. Uh, there's people in every discipline that are willing to support you no matter what your primary department is. And this interest and enthusiasm towards uh, academic research and development of academic careers is readily visible when you're in the training program. I knew that Mayo is a very good place for research in terms of having very well structured place that is very important. You cannot do research just by yourself. You need to go to have, you can have great ideas, but you need to have a very well structured program to help you with the research in terms of having people helping you to do the research and having good mentors. So these I, I knew I wanted to come to Mayo because of that. I had a very unique clinical interest that um, maybe only three or four other people have done uh, in this country specifically. I was able to find uh, people across disciplines that were uh, enthusiastic about mentoring me and working across disciplines uh, to make sure that I could realize my career goals.